guys welcome back to my channel so today i decided to tackle my laundry room it has been one of those things that for some reason i have just been putting on the back burner i mean not many people see it you know what it's like when you have rooms in your house like that um and we also rent and this flooring i would love to rip out but since this house is not mine um i'm just kind of dealing with it so it is an older house and so it's older flooring anyways so it's kind of has a lot of stains on it and things like that but i do wash it up the best that i can this is a stain remover that I've been really loving from 7th generation and I just decided to start a load of laundry. We just got back from being away over the weekend and we needed to just get some laundry started. So this is my laundry combination that I've been using for forever. It's from Method and I use their laundry soap, their softener, and then their boosters that are a bit like the Unstoppables, but more of a natural version. So I started out by kind of cleaning things up, putting some stuff away in the bins that they were supposed to be in. There were just a few things that were out of place and so just putting things away. I went ahead and used this Caldrea spray just to wipe everything down. And Corey was actually doing some cleaning in the garage, so he came in and washed something in the sink. The sink gets so much use just because it's right next to our back door and the garage. Also, the floor gets so dirty in here just because of it being a high traffic area. This is also another stain remover that I really love. Um, I don't know if one is better than the other, but I like the fact that the applicator has a little brush on it with this one, so I love to keep both of them on hand. Then I just use the Grove glass cleaner to wipe my jars off. Um, I love this glass cleaner. It comes in a concentrate and then you mix it up in that little glass bottle. Thank you. 
Okay, so I'm gonna explain the next part a little bit. So I am using my Norwex mop. I actually don't generally use this for the floors, but I love it to wash walls whenever I'm deep cleaning a room. So I just keep using it with water. Um, it doesn't need a cleaner because that's just the way that Norwex works. I'm not gonna take time to explain it, but it has its own way of working just the cloth itself. So um, that's what I use to wash the walls in the laundry room. To tackle the sink, I decided to use my Mrs. Meyers baking soda, paste, and vinegar gel. I used it on a bubble up scrub brush from Grove. I like to keep one of these down by my laundry room sink as well as by my kitchen sink. It's just a great scrub brush and I just scrubbed out the inside of the sink. It does have a lot of stains in it and so they don't all come out but at least I know it's clean. The floors were next, so I just swept everything up. And like I said, it's a high traffic area, so there's often a lot of dirt. And I got out my spin mop. I love this mop. It is my holy grail mop. I absolutely would highly recommend it to anybody that's looking for a mop. And I try to leave it linked below as well. After I got the floors all cleaned up, I went ahead upstairs and folded the loads of laundry that were sitting in the laundry room. And Corey kept talking to me and teasing me while I was folding the laundry. So if you see me talking or making faces, um, that is why. All right, you guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give this video a like, and I will see you in tomorrow's video.